Good morning, 7.10 Monday morning. Today we leave at 3, we fly the Citation XL and go to uh, Iowa City, pick up a couple, go down to uh, Sebring, Florida, spend the night. The next day we go over to Ocean Reef, get up one way rental over to Miami, fly out of Miami on American Airlines over to uh, St. Louis. They're calling for freezing rain starting tonight and going all the way through Sunday in the St. Louis area. Now we'll be out of here before that happens. The big issue is, are we going to be able to get back on the airlines? Or are we just going to get caught somewhere? I mean, who knows? We'll find out. Looks like another school day. Lots of traffic. I was just going to tell you guys, earlier this week I got a new first class medical. That's a good thing. After you get your medical, it is so easy to sit back and just relax and think, I got it, I'm good for another six months. And drop out of your exercise. I mean, you just got to push it, push it, push it, push it, make it a habit so you don't fall out of it. You guys know that. Well, we're just going to see what happens. One thing we always check on pre-flight is the aft equipment in the hell hole. Hell holes in the tail cone of the aircraft. One of the things we definitely check is the hydraulic reservoir. The hydraulic reservoir has a piston that comes out of it. There you see the black piston. There's a rod that moves in there that has an indicator on it where the green tab is right there and it's in between the two white lines so the fluid level is good the hydraulic fluid powers the uh the flaps speed brakes landing gear and the two position horizontal stabilizer all right we got somebody that's got a birthday today there we go it's the birthday, it's the birthday party plane. Happy birthday. Getting ready to go. They're heading down to Florida. We're getting ready to go. We're going down to Florida, but we got to stop in Iowa City first. 10 minutes, time to start it up. Let's get going. Lake Placid, Florida, 7.30 in the morning. All right, got to print some boarding passes. Hmm. Who even knows if we'll make it? I've noticed uh, there weren't many seats available at all, and now it's opening up. People are canceling. I decided not to go to the fitness center in the hotel. Just uh, go outside and take a walk. There's a lake out here. I'm going to walk around it. But uh, I'm looking out the hotel room window and there's this lady in her coat it's a winter coat and she's got a hood on and she's walking her dog i come out here and it's almost too warm for a long sleeve shirt it's 69 degrees oh well it's florida some type of aquatic bird there well there's the hotel on the other side of the lake right there that's where i started out at it's warming up well, I took what I thought was a shortcut back to the hotel. That obviously was not the case. I should be at the hotel now getting ready. Well, there's only so much I can do. I didn't realize there were any hills in Florida. Okay. This is not acceptable. Up. There we go. Yeah. 
We got crumbs everywhere. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to vacuum. No way around it. All right, let's make sure we got our fuel. Let's see, 2,990. Just about 3,000, that's what I was looking for. That works. I just gotta pay up and we're ready. Other than some passengers. Okay, let's go in and pay the piper. Took on 150 gallons. Okay, we're tight on time, but I'm gonna change my clothes anyway, wear some jeans. It's kinda of like... Okay, just dropped off the car. We are really running behind. I had to take care of the car. I sent Mike on ahead. I said, man, don't miss that flight because I'm stuck with this car. We don't start boarding till uh, 2.45. I've got a, a wife report. She said that they're getting ice on the deck on the patio furniture. Uh, she's not sure if there's any on the streets, but Modot is at their side, they're reporting ice on the streets. Mike's wife says no ice. We have conflicting wife reports. This is not good, not good. I got the pre-check, so that's really gonna help today. I made it, and we got a buttload of snacks here. See that? They're health bars, though. They're health bars. Looks like the back of the bus today. 34C. We got a 
run now. This is really going to be a tight connection here. They've canceled all the flights arriving after 9 p.m. at Lambert. We get in at 8, so we're still good if we can make the flight. Unless something's changed. This might just work. Okay, everything's coated with ice this morning. Streets were fine last night, they treated them, but when I got to my car, uh, the parking lot was just like a, a, no friction at all on it. My car was encased in a quarter inch of ice. Had to beat it off, but got home.